The next really important thing to do um, with respect to your WordPress installation is to have a backup plan. Um, I can't tell you how many times a business has been nearly brought down, if not brought down completely, because they lost their website. Now, this is completely unnecessary because it's pretty easy to back up your WordPress website. You just have to know a couple things. So, I typically choose um, cost effective or free measures versus, um, you know, something that's um, going to be a lot of money or very complex. So, I'm going to offer up three three solutions for you, um, actually four, um, for backing up your your WordPress website. And those four options really are: do it manually, or do it using plugins. Um, and the plugins are WP Twin, which we've talked about before, Backup Buddy, and there's a free uh, plugin on WordPress.org that proposes to do backups and restores completely free and painlessly. So what you have to keep in mind when you want to back up your WordPress installation is there are really two parts. WordPress contains files and it also has a database on the back end. The database contains all of your posts, um, the data within your posts, within your pages, um, any custom plugins you have may store data in a table, which is a uh, you know a part of a database. Um, so it's very important that you not rely on your web host um, for a backup because typically what happens is your web host they do do backups. They back up your files. They don't back up your database. So a WordPress um, website with files and not a database is pretty useless. So that's the overview. Um, next up we're going to talk about WP Twin.